Welcome to the second part of Large Numbers Rollover. In this lesson I'm going to have a look at some subtraction questions. Let's start with this one here. I've got $20,002 in my bank account and I spend uh, $7 and I want to work out how much money I'm left with. You can see over here I've got my $20,002 and down here I've got my bank. Now you can see the first problem that I've got here is that I need it to take away 7, but I've only got 2. So I'm going to have to break up one of these $10,000 notes. Now I know that uh, one $10,000 note is the same as $10,000, so I'm going to swap those over now. Move that down into the bank, and it's a straight swap for 10 of these. 1, 2, 3, 4... Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So that was just a straight swap, ten of those for one of those. Now you can see I've still got the same problem though, I still can't take away uh, the seven ones that I need to. So I'm going to have to swap one of these $1,000 notes for ten $100 notes. So I'll do that now, moving that $1,000 down here, swapping it for $1,000. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 10. But just like last time, you can see I've still got that same problem. I still can't take away these, uh, t these seven $1 coins yet. So I'm going to have to go back to the bank. I'm going to put this $100 in here, and I'm going to swap it for 10 $10 notes, because I know that 10 $10 notes is the same as 100. So there's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 9, and 10. Well, I'm getting closer to being able to do it, but I'm not there yet, so I'm going to have to swap one of these $10 notes for 10 $1 coins. So I'm putting that into the bank, and here are my 10 $1 coins. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So here, I've still got 20,000 and 2. It's now just arranged a little bit differently. <clears throat> and by doing that, it means that I can now take away these 7 ones that I need to. So let's delete those 7, or get rid of those 7 uh, that the question tells me I need to. There is 1 gone, 2 gone, 3 gone, 4 gone, 5 gone, 6 gone, and 7 gone. So now we just need to work out how much money is left. Well, I can see that here I've got 5 ones. Here I've got 9 tens. Here I've got 9 hundreds. Here I've got 9 thousands. And here I've got one $10,000 note. So, that it, so the answer to 20,002 minus 7 must be 19,995. Let's try another example. Um, this time I've got $13,004 in my bank account, and I spend $89, and I just want to work out how much money I've got left. You can see over here I've got my $10,000 note, my three $1,000 notes, and my ones, and down a little bit further here I've got my bank. Now you can see the question says I need to take away 89, but I don't have 89 here to take away. So I'm, what I'm going to have to do is break up one of these $1,000 notes. Now we know that $1,000 is the same as 10 $100 notes, so I'm going to swap one of these for $10 notes. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 
Now you can see I'm still not able to take away that 89, so what I'm going to have to do is swap one of these $100 notes for 10 of these $10 notes, because I know that 10 $10 notes is exactly the same as one $100 note. So I move that down there, and I'll put 10 of these up here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Now you can see at this point I do now have enough tens to take away that the, those eight tens, but I don't have enough ones here to take away these nine ones. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to break up one of these ten dollar notes for ten one dollar coins. So I'm swapping this ten dollar note at the bank for ten one dollar coins. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So the question over here says I needed to take away $89 uh, because that's how much I, I spent. So we can start by taking away these nine ones. So I could get rid of 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, and 9. But I'm not done yet because I still need to take away these eight tens. So I'm going to go back over here and take away 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, Eight, ten. Now I just need to work out what's left, and you can see I've got five ones here, one ten, nine hundreds over here, two thousand dollar notes, and one ten thousand dollar note, which means I've got twelve thousand nine hundred and fifteen left. So the answer to 13,004 minus 89 must be 12,915. Hopefully you've found this lesson helpful. For more lessons, check out teachertools.co.nz.